horrible. Hello? Hey, how's it going? What's horrible? The, the traffic's horrible? Yeah, it was like completely bottleneck, touch and go traffic all the way here. I'm sorry. That's all right. So, uh, Taylor, now you live in Nashville? Did we lose her? Hello? Uh, yeah, I heard a little bit of a... <laughs> I think we lost her. Who's messing with the board? Uh, oh, that was shorter than the other. I, 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 did, I didn't even ask about Kanye yet. They, I'm talking about Nashville traffic and they hung up on us. It's first Miley and now yeah, Taylor Swift hung up on you. Miley Cyrus hung up after 90 seconds. <laughs> she hangs up after nine. They'll, 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 they'll call us back. right back. You know what happened? Hold on, hold on, they, hold on. They, they patched her through. Pick it up. See if that's them. Hello? Is, is that them? You dropped it, huh? Okay. All right. Yeah, here they are. I know they called right back. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. Hello? 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 Hey, uh, Taylor? Hey, sorry. All right, no problem. Don't don't touch the button on the phone again. <laughs> oh, I didn't I didn't I didn't do anything. I know, I know the the engineer probably did it. Anyway, Taylor, welcome to the MJ Morning Show. How's it going? Great. So, you're saying that Nashville traffic was a bear this morning? It was not good at all. It was um hard to get in here on time. So, sorry, I apologize. That's yeah, not a problem. We're in the middle of our segment here. It's fine and and actually, you being just nine minutes late is actually pretty good for celebrities. You're actually in the top, uh, I think, uh, you're in the upper percentile of actual yeah. celebrities that actually uh, show up here. I'm usually not late at all, though, so I'm sorry. Nah, it's not a problem. Hey, listen, uh, let's get the Kanye West thing out of the way here. Uh, you know, bottom line is, a lot of people that have not been exposed to your fabulous music. I'm not blowing smoke here. You're talented. You've proven yourself as a crossover artist. You know, you're not just a, a pretty face that goes into a studio and they need all kinds of, you know, harmonizers and tricks and, and oh. overlays to make you sound good. I mean, you are a fabulous singer. You are a writer. You are a musician. You play. I mean, you, you really, you do it all, and I have a lot of respect for that. But the, the Kanye West incident, I think, has exposed you to a lot of folks that, believe it or not, didn't know about you, and now they're going to become fans. Well, I, you know, I think that the outpouring of love is what I focus on about that whole thing um and you know getting flowers from janet jackson was something i never thought would happen in my whole life um you know things like just everybody supporting and showing love it was it was really nice that people that i didn't even know who people that i didn't even think knew who i was were out there having my back and being really very kind to me so that was really a wonderful thing that you did not expect to win i mean there was there was shock. There was disbelief on your face. You won best female video. Uh, you know, you even said, you know, once you had a chance to actually deliver your acceptance speech, which I thought Beyonce was very classy to then yield some time and, and bring you up and let you finish. I thought that was very classy. But you were really shocked. You didn't think you were going to win. No. I Not mean, at all. I never presumed that I'm going to win anything, so... It was definitely a very exciting night. So you're up on stage, and I, I, I listen. I hate to make you go through this again, but you know our listeners want to know on our, our multiple you know, stations. I, honestly, I just am trying not to make it into a bigger deal than yeah. it already is. It's kind of become more of a big deal than I ever thought it would be. So I just, you know, it it happened on TV, so everybody saw what happened, and. Um, you know, I just would like to maybe move on a little bit. Did you think it was a scripted thing? Did you think that it was something that was set up? I mean, it, it, there must have been disbelief. I, I mean, you had a process. What is happening here? Well, you know, I um, I didn't know what to think, but I think that we should maybe talk about something else because um, I've talked about this, you know, in one interview, and that was going to be it, and... Um, you know, it just, it, it it's not something I feel like we need to keep talking about. Oh, it's good for your career, though. I'm telling you, it's good for your career, though, because you are the hero here. He is the zero. And you know, he did apologize. Was the, do you feel like the apology was sincere? I really would appreciate it if we could talk about something else because I've asked you three times now, and I'm trying to be nice about it because uh, it just isn't something that we need to spend this whole interview talking yeah, about. But, but Taylor, I mean, I got to be honest. You got to let me let me let me just give you a couple of tips here. You've got about ten or twelve radio stations lined up after me, and they're all going to want to talk about this, Taylor. Absolutely, but I think that if I ask them three times, and I've already talked about this in interviews, you know, like um, I went on the View and just kind of went 
through a brief overview of what went down and everything. And I'll tell you what, last last question, then we move on, okay? What, one more, and then I promise I'll move on, all right? Do you think, and I think it's a legi legitimate question, do you think that Kanye West, do you think he has hey a... Hey, guys, we've, yeah. we've got to move on past that question. I'm sorry. Can we talk about something new, like her record, You Belong With Me, going number one? And Yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I'm about to get... album platinum version yeah, coming out? Yeah, I'm about to get to that. Okay. You... I'm, I'm, about, I'm about to get to that, but, I mean, this is sort of the thing everyone's talking about. I, I, don't, I don't watch The View. I, I find them very obnoxious. <clears throat> Hello? Oh, wait, has she, like, has she walked away from the phone? Yeah. I mean, I, I hate to point this out, guys. You've got twelve stations lined up after me. Everyone's going to ask the same stuff. No, this is this is that's going to be addressed. And they're not going to ask that. Oh no! Yes, that's they the yes problem they will. That were yesterday were the points that were. I, uh, no one's given me any points. No one's given me any pointers. Well, any well, points. Was, Universal Public was to send those out. That, well, then somebody fell asleep at the switch because I never got. First of all, I don't do interviews where I get a list of demands of what I can't talk about. I. I, oh, no, no, no. Yeah. It's not a list of demands. No, sir. They just want to go on and move on from that because it's, you know, been, it's been passed on. Listen, but hold on. Listen, but for our audience, this is us, and we're interviewing her. It's, it's okay. new to our audience. Okay. You guys have been awesome. You have been so supportive, and you guys sound wonderful. But <laughs> I've got a job to do that I have to do on this end where I've got to go on to the other stations, and we'd ask just a couple of times that... She did address it, and then we moved on. Uh, can I say goodbye and, to her? Um, well, we've actually got the next station online ready to go. Well, that sucks. I'm sorry. I will tell her you said <laughs> goodbye. See? Next time you let Don Stanley handle this. Aw, I wanted to hear what, what, the she hell, what the hell is that all about? I want to hear what she had to say. We should have given it to Don Stanley to do. You're right. See, Bobby. you let Don Stanley handle these things the right way. You see, now, 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 let me tell you right now. I mean... Uh, Whatever radio station They're, she's on right now is asking her about it the, right now. The exact same thing. I thought I was very nice. I thought I was gentle. I thought I was delicate. I mean, if, what, what the hell was that? If a radio station is not asking her about it, they are derelict uh, in I, their duties to their listeners. My, my last question was going to be, do you think that Kanye West has a mental problem? Do you think Kanye West has a, a freaking screw loose? That was, my, that was my next question. How the hell are they uh, avoiding this? How, how they think they can avoid this? What do they think is going to happen? Got, they've got New York and Dallas and and Phoenix and Minneapolis. Do you think for a minute that that some of the stations are not going to be even tougher than me? Subscribe to this channel.